Whenever we need any information, whether for fun or serious work like planning, market analysis or research paper writing, we use tools like ChatGPT. These tools access the public information and give us helpful answers. With ChatGPT, it's like talking to a smart friend who always has the right answer ready for us, making our work easier and a lot faster. But with the free version of ChatGPT, which is 3.5, comes several limitations. First, it is not up to date and you may not get the real-time information on a particular topic. Second, it cannot generate an image as an output. And there are several other limitations too with the free version of ChatGPT. Hello and welcome back to AI series of Explore Bio with Dr. Abhishek. And in today's video, I will share with you a 100% working trick to use the latest version of ChatGPT, which is ChatGPT4, absolutely for free to get the real-time information about a topic and also generate an image based on the prompt or the query we provide. I personally find it very useful and routinely use it for my work. ChatGPT 3.5 is the free version which has several limitations, while ChatGPT 4 is the latest version but we need to pay $20 a month to use it. Suppose using ChatGPT 3.5, I want to know the latest prices for potatoes in India. It says that it cannot provide the real-time information. And in many such situations, it is essential to get up-to-date information, for example about the stocks, weather, prices for commodities, etc. Next, if I want to generate an AI image of father and a son doing potato farming, it says it cannot generate images. Coming on to the trick to use ChatGPT4 to get the real-time information and generate images. For this, we will search for Bing AI Chat. It will take you to the Microsoft Bing. Use the Copilot option. If you ask it its version, it will reply that it uses ChatGPT4. Now let's check if it can provide the latest prices for potatoes in India. And you can see it is providing the latest potato prices in various Indian cities. If you wish, you can ask related or more precise questions. Similarly, you can also get the latest weather reports. Now let's see how to generate an AI image as per our input text. So I want to generate an image of father and a son doing potato farming. But for this, I need to log in to the Microsoft account. If you do not have an account, you can create it. After logging in, I will try again to generate the image. You can see it is generating a few images. All the images are not real and they are AI generated. You can select one or more image and download it for usage. So that's all for the today's video. I hope you find this video useful. Do check out my various playlists on other interesting videos on AI, agriculture, techniques, research and publishing, nutrition health, plant tissue culture and lot more. 